Greetings, everyone. This is Collectibles Euphoria for another review of the Disney Tsum line, and this one is inspired from the movie Inside Out. The Inside Out Tsum Tsums were released on June 2, 2015, and is a wonderful addition for the Tsum Tsum collection line and Inside Out fans in general. Stay tuned! This Inside Out Tsum Tsum is the first line that was released even before the official movie release date. A lot of collectors still decided purchasing it due to the fact of knowing how popular the Tsum Tsum line is and would be a remorse for collectors if they ended really liking the movie but the Tsum Tsum is no longer available for purchase. Let's take a deep breath, relax, and get a close look at all of the emotions covered in this line. The Inside Out Tsum Tsum's collection is composed of six mini plushies which includes joy, sadness, disgust, anger, fear, and bing bong. These mini plushies, just like all other Tsum Tsums, are three and a half inches in length and are squishy, stackable plushies. Each mini Tsum Tsum retailed at $4.95 US dollars and $5.95 Canadian dollars. Starting off with Joy, her haircut is captured nicely with all the details made to it. I don't have complaint with eyebrows this time since all these Tsum Tsums have eyebrows which are really necessary to bring out the emotion being portrayed by each of the characters. Joy, of course, appears to be in her happy mode, as shown by her eyes despite not having a mouth to visibly see her smile. She also has pink blush on her cheeks. I really like how they nailed how she appears to be wearing the dress she wears in the movie. Just like all the other Tsum Tsums, her hands and feet are just small flaps sticking out of the bottom of the plush. Next is Sadness, and in all honesty, Disney is really getting better with providing outfits to their Tsum Tsums, making them appear to be more in conjunction with their original design. They also captured Sadness' haircut with her trademark oversized eyeglasses nicely embroidered. She is wearing her knitted top and captured the right hues for the color of her pants. This gust is also nicely presented with her green color scheme in her overall design, though I think they had a hard time trying to capture the disgust on her face. They did a good job though in capturing her excessively elongated eyelashes, and the design of her dress closely resembles her dress in the movie. Even the color scheme of the leggings she wore was also correctly done. They paid attention to the color schemes, even with the pink shoes which are really similar to the original color chosen. Anger's facial expression is spot on, and they even made an effort to embroider his eyes, eyebrows, and mouth just to really highlight the emotion he portrays, so thumbs up on that. They also place a flame design on the top of his head to show us how angry he really is. One thing I really do like about Inger's outfit is they even bother designing his necktie on the bottom of this Tsum Tsum, which really makes his outfit even more movie accurate. His pants are also in line with the color scheme in the movie. Even the color of his hands and shoes were nicely captured. Fear was also in line with the movie presentation with his embroidered eyebrows and hair sticking upwards. Another cute thing is the addition of the bow tie right below his neck area. His top and pants design and color is also accurate, making him a very nice addition to all the major character emotions in this movie. The Tsum Tsum that I think really is a nice addition to this line is Bing Bong. His overall design is really movie accurate with all the embroidery done just to show his facial features. He looks so cute with his itty bitty hat and bow tie. 
His top was also nicely designed, keeping accuracy in mind. His tail is also nicely colored in stripes, which adds character to his overall design. The inside out Tsum Tsum is probably the best looking Tsum Tsums ever made in terms of attempting to capture their essence in the movie. Attention to details are nicely incorporated and with no major drawbacks with the overall details and design. This Tsum Tsum line, just like all the other feature of the month, sold out fast despite of the movie not being shown yet at that time. Though, of course, not as quick as how Big Hero 6 and The Little Mermaid got sold out, which is expected, or to be expected since this movie wasn't out yet during the time of the release. This collection is a very nice addition to all Tsum Tsum series and for all Inside Out and Disney enthusiasts in general. Next Tsum Tsum feature for the month of July is Lilo and Stitch. So keep that in mind if you plan on completing the series or if you're a fan of the movie itself. Have a great day ahead. Bye!